Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today on Serendipity, we are going to be making homemade pizza with white sauce. So what you're going to need for this is you are going to need some Tyson grilled and ready uh, fajita style chicken breast. And they're already pre-sliced, so they're chicken strips. You'll need heavy whipping cream or light whipping cream. You'll need grated Parmesan cheese, and you will need non-original stone fire, it's almost like a pita bread. So for this, what you're going to do is you're going to start by getting four ounces of the heavy, heavy whipping cream. So you're gonna get four ounces of the heavy whipping cream ready, and you'll get one ounce of the grated Parmesan cheese. And go ahead and because I'm doing it kind of easy and not grilling chicken, I'm just doing it the easy way um, by the Tyson grilled ready strips. Um, I'm gonna heat those up on the stove. Uh, sometimes I'll do them in the microwave just because it's easy and it's fast and um, then everything will go in the oven. But um, today I will be doing it on the stove. So I went ahead and put these in a pan already and I'm starting to warm these up. And then in the other one, like I said, you're gonna use four ounces of heavy whipping cream or light whipping cream, whichever one is better for you. And you'll wait until this starts to boil. Once it starts to boil, then you'll go ahead and add in your grated Parmesan cheese. All right, so you'll just wait for that. And then you can kind of flip these whenever you think they're kind of ready. You're going to go ahead and make sure that they're thoroughly cooked through. Um, at least they're warm because they will heat up more in the oven once you put them in there. So while we're waiting on the chicken to finish cooking, we'll go ahead and get our non- I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm on paper, so I could be saying it all wrong. But you'll get that ready. Kind of stagger these. And then what I'll do is I will take and spread this sauce. See how thick it got? I'm gonna spread this sauce all over each one. Once you spread it around the sauce like you would on a pizza, you're gonna go ahead, and I forgot to mention, you're gonna add cheese. I'm just going to go ahead and add some Italian style blend. So I'm going to add just a little bit. I don't want too much because you will put this on the top. And then you'll add whatever toppings you want. So my husband and I, we do chicken. So I'll place all pieces of chicken all over and then after you place the chicken my husband likes pineapple so and it's been a while since I did one for him that has pineapple so he requested that and then after you're done adding, adding your toppings you will go ahead and then add the cheese on top and then after you're done with that you're going to put it in the oven at 400. I've already preheated it and it's ready to go in. So you're gonna put it in there for about 12 minutes and we will see what it looks like when it comes out. All right, y'all, it's been about 12 minutes in the oven and that is what they look like. So I will let them cool down and then I will slice um, one of them up into fours because that's how my husband likes it and then we will devour them all right make sure that you subscribe like share and ring that notification bell bye y'all